Hi guys, my name is Kat Kerr and today I'm going to be making this geometric art panel and I'm going to be using Amsterdam acrylic paints for the very first time so I'm looking forward to trying them out. Now I knew that I wanted to create some sort of geometric shape on my art panel so the first thing I'm doing is I'm using my Talon's Art Creation Sketchbook and I'm drawing out different patterns until I draw one that I like and so this is the one that I ended up liking and I'm simply going to copy it directly onto a wood gessoed panel and use it as a guide. Now I decided to keep my color choices simple and so I picked these four beautiful colors that I thought went nicely together. Today I'm using Amsterdam's turquoise green, azo orange, perm red violet light, and yellowish green. Now I'm also mixing in some of that white gesso and that is just to give me some variation on the hue uh, for each color I want some dimension and so I normally end up adding the color straight from the tube um, on the edges and then I'll mix in a little bit of that white gesso to the center just to give it a little bit of dimension. I'm continuing to add the same colors as well as some of that gesso. My goal is to really end up with a nice rich color palette. Next up I'm using Amsterdam Oxide Black Acrylic Ink to add these black lines. I decided to use the acrylic ink because number one it is fully opaque. It says it right on the bottle uh, what uh, opacity it is and it's also really smooth and easy to work with. Next up I'm using a fine liner and that acrylic ink to add these squiggly lines. My goal was to have this geometric shape but I had to add some whimsy. Lastly I finish up this piece by using an Amsterdam white acrylic marker to add these dots. I paint the sides of the panel and this piece is done. For the complete list of materials used in this tutorial, see the description below. And for more ideas using Amsterdam acrylic paints, check out royaltalons.com. Thanks for watching.